Your guests appear to be enjoying this relaxed atmosphere. Would you like me to keep everything at its current intensity? This is nice. Let's keep things laid back. Yes, Commander. Drink! I'm drinking! But it's not a drinking game. Afraid to lose? Shepard? Grunt? Shepard! Rex? Commander Shepard. Shepard, Shepard, Shepard. Rex? Grunt? Shepard! Shepard! Shepard? Shepard. Grunt. Shepard. Rex. Commander Shepard. Shepard, Shepard, Shepard. Rex. Grunt. Shepard. Protheans can read the smallest details of our environment. Tattooed humor. I would like to touch you. <laughs> I'm not nearly drunk enough for that. You then, shuttle pilot. How about you? Um, why is Javik getting all touchy-feely? Hey, collector-looking asshole. Maybe go touch yourself. That does not happen until the end of the party. <laughs> Commander! Javik? Apologies. I have been drinking the provided drinks. Sure. Uh... You might want to tap the brakes a little. Everyone having a good time? Will there be food available soon? You're hungry, Edie? No. However, my research suggests that serving intoxicants without nourishment is considered unwise. I can eat. In my cycle, we had food. Many of varieties. You feeling okay? I am Prothean. I never feel okay. So this drink is changing that. Hmm. Know what I could go for? Fish and chips. Greasy, salty, crispy, flaky, melt in your mouth. Yes, that. Let's get that. Shall I arrange some fish and chips, Shepard? Steve, is that your favorite? Actually, I'm a dessert guy. My aunt used to make this chocolate lava bomb cake. When I first escaped from Cerberus, I found these chocolate chip cookies at a store. <sighs> Ripped through the whole damn thing. Nothing in this cycle compares to the food of my people. Maybe you should get cooking then, Javik. Most of our ingredients are extinct. Except Krogan. Sarin, Durian, Valerian, and Quarry. Is there any we could spare? Hope you don't feel left out, Edie. Do not worry. I've been employing a socialization protocol feature that came with this unit. It is called Smile and Nod. Okay, I'll see about arranging more food then. You know, forget food. This bar is impressive. Let's crack open this bad boy and see what we can come up with. Beverages. More would be preferable to not. Sure, help yourself to the bar. But I'd steer clear of the creme de menthe if I were you. Oh my god, you ain't kidding. That stuff will make you sicker than pure wrinkle. Whew, trust me. Shit, it is disgusting. So, talking about food at a party, like, for fun. Lord? Is there a place I can go light something on fire? The fireplace is right there. Eh, it's not the same. Nice party. And relax a bit yourself, okay? We'll see. so they upgraded the ventilation system. More of a 
<laughs> That's actually what it sounds like. There is a lot more space now. But if you move further up, it's more of a... <laughs> a what? You have to imagine my arms are the wings. <laughs> of course. Over by the med bay. Exactly! What are you guys talking about? Tally was acting out the differences between the original Normandy and the SR2. Acting? It was... evocative. It was a surprisingly accurate demonstration. Yeah, but which one's better? The SR2 is harder to perform. Does that make it better or worse? The SR1 was a decent ship, but the SR2 gave the Normandy a fresh start. It made it something truly great. Just look at what it accomplished. The SR2 made a good ship better. The original Normandy was developed by the Turian Council and the Alliance. It's a symbol of cooperation between members of the galactic community. And we wouldn't be where we are now without it. We wouldn't have the SR2 if it hadn't been for the original Normandy. It was a great ship. It made the quietest little sounds. A sort of... Shoo. You know what I'm talking about? Hey, no touching, asshole. I mean no harm, tattooed human. I have read you. You don't need to read me. Just ask and I'll tell you exactly what I think. Yes, this is what I have read. <laughs> uh, this place is a goddamn joke. Sightlines aren't bad. One point in its favor and I'm supposed to be impressed. And what the hell is this supposed to be? What are you guys doing over here? Looking at this poor excuse of an apartment, that's what. What's wrong with it? What would you do if another one of your clones broke in here, eh? Offer them a cup of tea? Ah, <sighs> there are too many windows, and they're, they're too big. Makes it easy for someone to track your movement. But it's got potential. Be easy to set up a defensible position over there. I'd extend a wall out, prevent someone sticking you in the back. Mmm, 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 good idea. Mmm. Wish I could have done that back in the day on Omega. Why don't you two relax and enjoy the party? The apartment's fine. Fine? Huh. Suppose tomorrow it's Liara's clone that comes after you. Mm. Or Joker's. Yeah, him. Twitchy little guy. Might already be a clone. An evil one at that. All right. Have fun. Shepard, you moved the Normandy's main battery into here, and I think I'm home. So, Edie said you found her voice attractive. Well, actually, she said the word you used was like, <gasps> or something. Uh, that was when I thought she was a VI. Anyway, you'd just better treat her right, Moreau. Oh, somebody jealous? I think you had a better shot when she looked like a holographic chess piece trainer. I wouldn't have said chess piece precisely. But listen, the point is, you hate AIs. You had to overcome all your hang-ups, whereas I was totally fine with AIs to begin with. Other fish in the sea, trainer. Not with that voice. It's like feeling smoky satin slide across your skin in soft candlelight just mm. wait are you two arguing over edie no probably not okay you know she smashed my head against the side of a shuttle i know twice i heard it from liara that was like forever ago Plus, it wasn't Edie back then. It's really unfair of you to even bring it up. 
Yeah, what the hell was I thinking? Probably just brain damage making me touchy. Apology accepted. Well, I'm glad you two are drunk enough to finally deal with this. Oh, we weren't planning to deal with it. We're just happy giving each other shit. We can call Edie over, and you can discuss your feelings like mature adults. What? No. That would be weird. Just... just no. You don't think she knows? You guys, she's the Normandy AI. He sees every extranet site you browse. Note to self, delete browser history. I can show you how to set up an automated task for that. I heard that... Not enjoying the party, Samara? Oh, yes, Shepard. I am. Although not in the same way as the others, perhaps. Are you worried about me? Don't be. I only stepped away for a moment to use the restroom. And then I found this quiet corner. Reflecting on one's place in the universe while a party rages within reach can feel oddly self-affirming. Meditating isn't often considered party behavior. Perhaps. Is everyone all right? Can I get it?